the president of Harvard University, Dr. Claudine Gay, holding on to her position at the top Ivy League. And this is desp despite more allegations of plagiarism. Some of those have already been brought forward. Now there's more allegations. Now, we interviewed a woman named Dr. Carol Swain right here on National Report on Wednesday. Now she's releasing even more details about her allegations against Harvard's president. And, and the allegations keep getting uh, more and more uh, pronounced here. So we have national correspondent Mike Carter. He is live in the New York Root newsroom with more. Mike. Hey, good morning, guys. Well, that's right. Harvard University says it still supports embattled President Claudine Gay, even as more accusations of academic plagiarism are now coming to light. Harvard says a recent review of Gay's work uncovered more examples of duplicative language without appropriate attribution in Gay's 1997 doctoral dissertation. The Harvard Corporation says Gay will now update her dissertation, correcting three instances of inadequate citation. Earlier this week, a 37-page document was submitted to Harvard's Research Integrity Officer, which outlined more than 40 instances of Gay plagiarizing others' works word for word. The alleged plagiarism ranges from missing quotation marks in a few cases to entire paragraphs lifted verbatim in others. Previous to this latest round of allegations, Gay, the Harvard, against Gay, the Harvard Corporation says it completed an independent review of Gay's work and found no violation of Harvard's standards for research misconduct, though Gay had previously submitted four corrections in two articles that were the subjects of Harvard's initial review. In this book, we talk about the history of affirmative action and how it evolved. Dr. Carol Swain, who accuses Gay of plagiarizing her work, says Harvard must look past Gay's status as its first black female president and do what's, do what's right, fire her. With Claudine Gay, she attended Phillips Exeter Academy. She's had a world-class education. There's no excuses. If, and I just feel that there's a system that pushes certain kinds of blacks of certain pedigree, and I believe that she has written on coattails, in particular my coattails, and it's not about me. This is much bigger than me. This is about American education. According to the most recent data on violations of Harvard's academic integrity policies, 27 students were forced to withdraw from Harvard College during the 2020-2021 academic school year due to academic dishonesty. The House Committee on Education and the Workforce, which is investigating Harvard's president, warns the school could lose federal funding if it finds Harvard did not take claims of widespread plagiarism against gays. Seriously. That's you guys. All right. Thanks so much, Mike yeah. Carter, for that report. Forty instances now of plagiarism there. Claudine Gay.